Hey everyone, uh, welcome back to Freedom City 1165 in Surviving Mars, Below and Beyond. Well, uh, last time there was a bunch of stuff underground. Got the second uh, underground entrance elevated up. We're almost 50% atmosphere, which means dust storms should be going away soon. Um, we're a little further away from getting rid of cold waves. But that means that the game is just about one, uh, you know, from a practical standpoint, especially since we have the Mohole Mine and this guy, right, uh, which means uh, there's just that much less stuff that needs, uh, well, uh, doing. I should re really uh, put uh, uh, scrubbers on this thing. We got scrubbers. Do we have scrubbers on the mohole? I think we might. But anyway, we're producing 21 machine parts and using like 11, right? And we're producing like three polymers, but that's probably because our storage is full. And yeah, we're, we're, we're producing a bunch of electronics and all of that jazz. So... What does this mean for, for anything? Well, uh, it does occur to me that I need to do some stuff up here on the surface. Uh, and that's uh, just because we only have 22 vacant living spaces, right? So, it seems like it might be a good idea to build a few apartments or something, right? Well, if I go in here and if I look in Spires, I could build a... I could build... Eventually in arcology, but no, I don't have I don't have the the research for that. Um, right, so that means that I should go into homes, and I suppose I could go ahead and build a few apartment complexes over here. Um, right now. Hmm. Let's go with that one. Yeah. Um, yep. And... Uh, okay, so that... Build a few of those there. And that will allow uh, uh, a bit more uh, room... Now let's check in here on the uh, research, and we have a bunch of stuff going on here. Yeah, just a bunch of stuff. Uh, dream reality, etc. So basically, I'm working down the list here. Just research everything, just for the the kicks, right? So uh, yeah, maybe I should just I should. Uh, Let's just chuck these in, too. Nah. Um, now, what's this one? Yeah, we'll grab that one. Okay. Now, do we have any outsourcing? We, no, we're already doing it. Good. Well, uh, we can just observe here the drones are doing their thing here. And that will get us a whole bunch of stuff uh, constructed. Yeah, that's basically the whole operation, right? There we go. We have more living spaces. Yes. Okay. That will get us a bunch of... Yeah. That'll get a bunch of stuff going on here. Uh, oh, you should be work, work, working all shifts. Um, yeah. 
Uh, we've completed large scale excavation, which means we can get infinite concrete. Uh, right. Uh, what do I. Oh, right. I was going to go into dome services and I was going to put a. another. Uh, grocer in. And I was going to put uh, a diner in. Yeah. Why? Well, just because. This is uh, lots of stuff in here, and it just seems like it might be a thing to do. And we end up soaking up a bit more uh, of the population for working. Uh, and that also seems like it might be sort of useful, right? Um, yeah. Okay, so we've got that going on. Um, we've got a rocket coming back from uh, an anomaly, the mysterious dome structure, right? Um, right. And we've got two rockets that are uh, exporting, uh, doing uh, rare metals exports, right? Uh, yeah, that's that's all uh, that's all excellent. Yep. Okay. Ooh, we got 500 colonists, and we got a uh, fireworks display. Wild. Uh, let's uh, let's actually uh, jump into the uh, mission profile here. Uh, construct a mega dome. That's the last uh, uh, mission sponsor or, or uh, thing here. Um, milestones. All sponsor goals: thousand colonists, mega dome, plant a tree, dig a lake, rainfall breathable. Yeah, okay. Maybe we can actually get all of these. You look at them breathe. Yeah, okay. Uh, maybe we can get all of those. Yeah, possible. Uh, right. Okay. That's gaining at 0.6 per... Yeah, okay. That will... That will tip over to... Uh, yeah, 50% soon. Let's go check in underground here. Okay. So, we have stuff happening underground here. Um, that's the or original elevator. That's the new one. Okay, so we've got the, the full... Oh. Uh... Wait, can I build lights down here? Uh, uh, support struts. Um... No. Um. Okay. I haven't researched whatever the... Oh, light tripod. Wait, no, wait. No, that was... Self-sufficient lights. Okay. So these are self-sufficient. Okay. Well...
Yeah, put a few of them up so I can kind of see stuff. Yeah. Being able to see stuff might be useful. Um... Yeah, let's put a few of them up and uh, see what we can get uh, for visibility. Because if we could see what's going on around places, that might be sort of useful. Right. Um, okay. Now, what do these take for maintenance? Nothing. Ah, that's cool. Okay. Ah. That's a cave-in. And a cave-in. And a cave-in. Yeah. Okay, I think I need another light over here. Say, right about here. Oh, there's a collapsed tunnel there, so there's access to more stuff over this way. Okay. Right. So that's uh, a useful thing to know. Um... I'm, I'm trying to think if there's maybe another mystery that we haven't found yet down here. That's the uh, that's the question that I uh, I kind of want to uh, answer here. Uh, this is out of range of uh, any uh, drone hub operation, isn't it? Uh, okay, so if I were to chuck a drone hub, say here. And I were to chuck a uh, one of these here, uh, and don't store uh, seeds or fuel there. Yep, uh, that will that will go up, and that will get us a little bit more stuff uh, we can be doing down here. Uh-huh. Right. There we go. There it goes. Whoosh. There we go. Now, I need to also uh, grab a power operation there. Yep. Cave in. Cave in. Okay, uh, this will, that will go up and that will, that will power it, yes. Okay. Uh, just need some polymers. Okay, one more polymer. There it, there it comes. Whoosh. And we have, we have power, yes. Okay, so these lights and all of that just get us a nice uh, view of what's going on down here. How is everything uneven terrain there? Okay, put a light there. Um, okay, where's the, where's the rover? Where is the rover? Come on, where's where did I park the rover? I parked the rover there. Okay, well, you come this way. Yeah, and we can see what's over here, right? Uh-huh. 
And the rover is a coming. Yes. Uh, meanwhile, let's check in on the surface. We've got toxic rain. Oh my. Um, yeah, toxic rain. Oh, uh, we have an anomaly. Oh. Okay, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to pause it here, and I'm going to get down to the surface here, and I'm going to observe the colony here from this this um this angle here yeah okay so we've got the sky up there right so this guy's out of range okay anomaly found whatever and toxic rain When this goes to 50%, the sky should turn blue. Uh, yeah. So we're just going to sit here and wait for the sky to turn blue, which is going to do over bloody night, isn't it? It is, isn't it? Um, yeah, well, then we'll get to observe a uh, sunrise. Well, we also have the uh, quake going underground. Yeah. Toxic rain is going to be is over. Yep. Yeah. And uh, here we go. It's nighttime. And nine, seven, ninety nine. Atmosphere cleared. Blue skies. Okay. No more recurring dust storms. That's a milestone. Not uh, an official milestone, but. Uh, now we can just wait until the sunrise happens and we can see... Uh, you can see the quality of the light here actually just changed as well. The red tint is gone. We've got a cold wave in three sols. Yeah, and a uh, another science lump. Let's jump in here. Let's uh, outsource uh, some more. I mean, we have some cash, so why not? Uh, right, so that's in the queue add that to the queue yeah i'm just uh working through the research now there's nothing uh, exciting so here we go we've got sunrise on mars with a with a blue sky and look at that eh uh yeah quite the different uh, uh appearance there with the with the blue sky right Yeah. Uh, okay. Enough of that. Um, yeah. So it's uh, it's all doing its thing there, right? It does make the uh, frozen bits quite a lot more obvious, though, doesn't it? Um. Uh, yeah, it kind of does. Well, anyway, um, that was a major uh, point there. So, uh, we analyzed a anomaly. Uh, which one? That's the explorer. Bring the explorer home. Yeah, uh, let's just jump back down here. Uh, we have faults here. Uh, well, we've got that and that and that and that and that one too and that one and that one. Oh, look, another one and another one and that's all of them. Okay, so we can let those uh, get um, cleared and repaired, right? Um, 
Uh, what if I open this one? And this one? Not enough power. Uh-huh. Okay, so we're... What? Why don't we have enough power with those open? Um... I think I can just build another Sterling there, right? Eh? Uh, let's build two more there. Yeah, we'll do we'll do a couple more, and yeah, build those. Then if the Uh, if that gets us enough power there, that would be useful. Um, right, okay. Okay, well, that's not helping anything. Um, uh, okay, you're gone. Good. Okay. Wait, you... Clear rubble. Yeah. Uh huh. And you repair. And can't find any metals nearby. Huh. Repair that one. And then then you uh repair that one. And then you uh repair that one. And then you uh clear rubble. Yeah. Okay. Okay. You uh repair, right? Uh-huh. Then you repair and then you uh, re oh, uh, now we've got, uh, full, now that, that's got everything cleared out, so we have enough power to actually do anything there. Uh, that is good. Now, down here, uh, shall we go this way? Yeah, we got that. And that. Oh, we've got a anomaly over here. Uh, okay. That is a rare anomaly. Okay. Well, we'll see what happens with our rare anomaly here. Uh-huh. Um, also... I want a light over here, yeah, so I can just see what's doing there. I uh, will see what rare anomaly analyzed. Uh, a few probes, etc., etc., etc. Okay. Uh, 
scrubbers, shuttle hubs, underground basic domes, recon centers. Um, scrubbers? Uh, okay. Uh, right. Okay, we've got light over there. So I guess we need to know, now go and look this way. And see what's here. And that is nothing. Okay, so we have now explored that completely. Uh-huh. So... We don't have anything over there. Okay. So... Uh, I guess uh, I, I can go and uh, drop another light uh, over here. Yeah. Whoops. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. That's too far away from the drone hubs, huh? Okay. Well... Put one of those there and go in here. I'm going to want one of you. Yeah. And then come along with uh, a storage. And then take that and that out of there. Okay. And those need to clear. Yeah. Okay. We've got an open space over here, by the look of it. Yeah. Uh, close that. Yep. Yeah. Okay, so how are we doing here? Uh, you... Okay, just needs a couple more. Yeah, and that needs a little bit more. Yeah. Well, that's making some progress at least. And then... Okay, here we go. Uh, we've got stuff coming. Uh-huh. Ah, we've got drones bringing stuff. Right. And the drone hub goes up. It doesn't have power. Uh, so we just need a few more uh, electronic type things. Right. And whoosh. Oh, come on. Well, three more, three more are coming. Okay. Right. We got that. We got that and that. And there goes the Sterling. And the drones leap into action. Right. Okay. So, we can go this way and take a look. Right. Okay. So, that can clear that can clear that can clear okay so if you come this way okay Let's see here. What have we got? There's an open space here. Okay. And we've got cave-ins. 
Um, do that. Do that. Do that. Do that. Right. Okay, so stuff is uh, ticking along down here, repairing things. Uh huh. There we go. There's more stuff happening. Right. Okay, back to the uh, Dewey here. Okay. Oh, we found... Uh, oh, wow. There's a whole bunch of stuff here. Uh-huh. Knew there had to be another open space down here. Ah! Okay. We found uh, another one of these Deweys. And some sort of light source. Uh huh. Well, we got some sort of a light source here. Um. Was well, this another one of those uh, caves that gets uh, support structure? Oh, this looks like a, uh, a, it's shaped like. A, Ancient artifact. Ah, it's the ancient artifact. Okay, it is a mystery. Um, okay. We've completed Dream Reality. Project Morpheus is available. Uh-huh. Can you get there? Yes, you can. So, I'm going to... Uh, I'm going to start that going. Uh, I'm pretty sure this one, if we do it right, we end up with a global drone controller for the underground. Pretty sure. Uh, I'm not entirely sure uh, exactly the uh, situation, but uh, I'm def definitely going to let this uh, reveal itself here. Uh, we're going to jump up here just for a, uh, uh, a look here. Uh, blood music, prophase. Huh. Uh, a colonist has somehow been completely changed overnight, not just, uh, etc. Uh, Martian has lost all traits and gained the... Okay. Acting quickly, etc. Uh, researchers. Anomalous genome resequencing. Okay, well, if we uh, jump in here and we, uh, we might as well do that research. Do we, yeah, we can outsource. We'll do that. Uh, good. We have a cold wave for 12 hours. Yeah. Uh, okay, we still have lots of uh, living spaces. Uh, we have analyzed an anomaly. Uh, we've got... Uh, Meteor coming in. Yeah, just generally all around fun. Uh, right, so that's that's cool. We're at 53% atmosphere, so, you know, everything's all cool there. Now, if we jump back down here, uh, we have the anomaly analyzed. Uh, okay. Okay. Uh, it said our explorer vehicle systems blocked out. All attempts are failed. It seems like et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. We detected radio waves coming from the device. Our engineers think they could build an artifact interface, etc. cetera. Uh, some scientists, however, think we should experiment more before uh, diving into such costly research. Uh, the ancient artifact control tech has 
become available, research it to build the artifact interface, uh, which should allow us to make use of the thing. Um, right. Uh-huh. So I think I need to uh, plop a... It feels like I should plop a drone hub out here, right? Uh, yeah, it does feel kind of like I should. Um, yeah, okay. Uh, funding... Okay, the ancient artifact, power it. We discover the drones that spent time closer as a traditional. Uh, there is no scientific consensus yet. Powering the artifact. Uh, power the artifact. Wait until the interface is ready. Okay. Uh, we'll wait until the interface is ready. Yeah. Uh, and I am going to go in here, grab one of these, drop it there, and I'm going to also uh, add a sterling. Yeah. And then I can go ahead and just for giggles... Uh, just go and grab one of these. Uh, no seeds, no fuel. Okay. Uh, so that will allow everything to spring into action there. Uh, we just so have finished anomalous genome re resequencing. Um, yeah. I think I'll let that complete, we'll let this complete, and uh, run around in here and uh, finish uh, clearing a bunch of this stuff. Yeah. Okay. The interface, I think, is going to require a bunch of these, and... Uh, yeah, I think we have enough, actually. Uh, okay. Okay, so that is getting the clearing happening here. Cave in. Clear. 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 Whole bunch of stuff. Yeah, just clear a whole bunch of, of stuff here. Uh, open the floor up so some things can happen. Yeah. You. I like how you can find cave-in just by randomly clicking. Uh, that just seems somehow cheaty, doesn't it? Anomalous genome... Resequencing. Okay, we'll just jump back up here. Um, we have we've discovered the reason our, our construction nanites. They have mutated and changed their behavior slowly, melting our colonists, species, etc. Uh, our research team has discovered the kill switch mechanism. Um, uh, Um, huh. Huh. Stop this immediately. One final transformation. Let's do one final transformation. Uh, just because, right? Um, okay. And 
jump back down here and take a look here. Uh, we have a whole bunch of stuff has cleared here. Oh, there's a, another cave in there. Yeah. Okay. Why don't you go over here so we can see what's doing. Ah, there's one of those. Oh. There's corridors up here. Aha. Uh -huh. Oh. Okay, yeah. Oh. Oh. A uh, anomaly. What have we found here? Um. Okay, you go there. Ah, we've got a uh, we got a collapsed tunnel. Uh, ah, okay, that should get into this part here, right? Okay, well, uh, let's uh, jump into the, the science here. Uh, we'll uh, dump ancient artifact controls uh, into there. Uh, that's an expensive research. It'll take a minute. Um, right, we'll find out what this is. New planetary anomalies found. What have we found? Research progress. Research progress. Research progress. Unknown. Let's do the unknown one. There aren't any available rockets. Okay. Uh, let's go, go up here. Do we we don't have any any rockets, huh? Okay. Um can I build a rocket? I can build a rocket. Blocking objects. You go over there. Right. Okay. No. Go in here. Rocket build. Okay. Build a rocket. Seems like the sort of thing we can do. Uh, we have the resources. We can build rockets. Yeah. Yeah, it definitely seems like a good idea. Building rockets. It's always useful when you have the, the resources to uh, do something like that. Uh-huh. There we go. Rockets going up. Whoosh. Okay, now we can go over here. Send expedition. Send. Right. Okay, we got that. Let's uh, jump down here and see. Uh, rare anomaly analyzed. Uh, rumbles. Uh, probes rail picked up. Rumbles come from deeper in Mars. Uh, something that may indicate Mars is still, etc. Uh, investigate ways to capture asteroids and get exotic minerals. Explore the underground as fast as possible. Start building support struts now. Explore the underground as fast as... No, let's, uh, let's do this one. We have unlocked the Capture Asteroids Breakthrough. Aha! Okay, so that will make it so we can just complete... Oh! Oh, oh, that'll be good with the, 
with that breakthrough uh, for idle for empty uh, deposits, you capture an asteroid that has uh, that has the exotic uh, minerals. Oh, oh, I like that. Okay. Uh, well, let's just um, handle these. Okay, now let's jump back up here. Evidence against dark matter. Okay. In our most recent observations, we found evidence, etc., our current model of gravity doesn't explain, etc. And uh, right, uh, keep using existing model. Get research boosts or physics texts. Use new model. We use the new model. Scientists are excited. We gain five k uh, research into the ancient artifact controls. Yes, that is extremely uh, helpful. Uh, right. And I think that should be just about it for for this one. But we'll just uh, check in here. Um, yeah. Okay. Uh, so over here. Uh-huh. So we need to clear some stuff here. Yeah. Ah, this is our other path into the uh, the chamber there. Okay. Well, in that case, let me grab a few tripods. Um, since these are just using polymers, yeah, we can stick a bunch of them up. Yeah, stick a bunch of them up, light a bunch of stuff up, and then we can kind of see what's doing. You can get cleared too. Oh wow, look at all that lit up space. Okay, what's over here? Uh, more stuff. Blocking the way. Okay, uh, grab another uh, tripod or two. Okay, um, that, okay, that can be cleared. Yeah, okay. Okay, so more lights are up. Uh, you can come back down this way. Yeah. Okay, that's got that's got that sorted. Uh huh. So bring the rover back. Yeah. Oh, uh, what I what I should do is also stick a tripod uh, right about here. Yeah, uh, that will. That lights up that gap. Okay. Well. Well, that's uh, that's going to be all for this this uh, episode. Uh, if we uh, step out here, we can see there's quite a bit of. Um, oh, there's stuff over here that still needs to be 
there's still a bunch of stuff to explore down here. But uh, with the lights on, uh, we can start to see uh, what the situation is down here. And there's uh, quite a bit more stuff to uh, to poke around with. So I'll keep I'll keep exploring down here in the next uh, couple episodes. We'll also finish the uh, artifact uh, uh, log. And uh, with the capture asteroids thing, well, that's going to be uh, absolutely uh, brilliant for uh, exploiting what's up there. Uh, you know, if you can capture an asteroid, it's there as long as you need it, right? Uh, so, yeah. Uh, well, anyway, that is definitely it for this episode. I'm just going to pop up on the surface here and just uh, leave it here. And, right. Well, that's, uh, that's going to be uh, quite enough uh, for now. I'll just, on the way out, I'll mention that I have a Patreon if for some bizarre reason you want to support the channel. Uh, if not, well, you can ignore that. The link is in the description and you do with it what you will. Uh, all that said, uh, see you back next time.